Now all new at six. Typically, it would be a hurricane that would shut down the charter boat business in the Florida Keys. Company owners have gotten used to that over the years. But the COVID-19 pandemic is impacting charter boat businesses in a way never experienced before. CBS 4's Hank Tester explains. It's tough going for charter boat captains in the Florida Keys. We talked to one captain who has four boats, four of them essentially sitting idle. Captain Marlon Scott's Fish Monster Charters has a fleet of four vessels. They operate out of the A&B Marina in Key West. Tourists banned in the Keys. It makes a charter boat business during the pandemic downright scary. But there's no way in the world that the local population can support a fleet that was built on one of the, you know, one of the best years ever. Uh, the last few years have been a huge market. So there's a lot of boats that have been bought. There's a lot of investment that has been done. And a lot, and you can't support that just on the local. Key's locals can charter. Key West is pretty much open for business, but the local market, not enough to support the fish monster overhead, much less what small staff is left. Uh, we have some locals that wanted to get out. They've been uh, in their homes too much. <laughs> <'Cause you can laughs> tell, when they get on the boat, hang. oh my gosh, they are so excited <laughs> to get out on the water. The captain says he's getting requests for booking starting almost immediately, but clients can't get to the Keys, shut off by a checkpoint. Only residents allowed in, and possibly the reason the Keys has such a low occurrence of the coronavirus. That will probably help us greatly once they open up US-1. It's slated to be closed all of May. We don't know if they're going to do a June opening or not. Once we open, if you, I know you've seen it there when the boat ramps open and everything. <laughs> right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're going to see. We're going to see some flow down here for sure. This fishing crowd, they're used to hurricanes, but never a worldwide pandemic. I've got to be optimistic. I mean, I, I'm not going to be down here on an island and being sad. No way. I'm going to be happy. <laughs> Thousands have been turned back at that Keys checkpoint, but it's certainly an indication there is a huge pent-up demand for folks to get their boats and themselves back into the Conk Republic. I'm Hank Tester, CBS 4 News.